What's up guys and welcome back to another video right onto my YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna basically tell you how what you're gonna do in order to fix the FPS dropping, frame dropping or stuttering issue in Civilization 6. So stick to the end guys, this will be a step by step tutorial and in the end you will probably know what to do in order to fix this kind of issue. Before we start right into the video, I just want you guys to know, let you guys know that I would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like, a comment or a subscription right into my YouTube channel. It would really make my day and help me out as a little YouTuber as I am. Especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys. You would support my work on YouTube a little bit and I'm gonna really be, really be thankful for that. And I'm gonna thank you for that. So anyways, I would just say, let's get right started. So the first step in order to fix this kind of issue is gonna be to navigate to the bottom of your screen, right clicking your taskbar and opening up your task manager. The next step is going to be to navigate to the top left corner of your screen just to ensure that you're sticking around processes and what i want you to do next is going to be to click into cpu and end every single task which is currently running and has nothing to do with windows obviously and is having too much cpu usage by just simply right clicking it and clicking onto end task they also want you to do this for your GPU. So let me explain that. Too many applications, background processes, programs or games running at the same time with too much CPU or GPU usage on a low end or bad PC will cause your PC to have FPS drops, stutterings or frame drops. And by simply ending those tasks, you're avoiding this issue. So once you're finished, I want you to end the task manager. The next step is going to be to navigate to your bottom left corner, clicking onto the Windows symbol and opening up your settings. Navigating right into gaming and sticking around the Xbox game bar, where I obviously want you to turn this off because the Xbox game bar doesn't really come with any benefit besides impacting your performance and um, causing stutterings. So simply turn this off. Next up is gonna be to click onto captures and go to background recording and go to record in the background while I'm playing a game and obviously turn this off because especially if this is turned on without you knowing that this will impact your performance really bad. Everyone knows if you're recording something, it will impact your performance. And either way, I just, guys, just turn this off. You, don't want to record something with Windows, so just come back once in a while to check if this is really turned off. Next up is going to be to click into game mode, and I can really tell you now to turn this off or on. You need to check it for your system specifically, and uh, just work, just stick with deciding which is working better. So go back once and navigate to update and security, and stick around Windows update. And I know guys, it's going to sound a little bit basic, but trust me, updating every single driver you could possibly update on your PC will help you a lot of every kind of issue you're currently having, and also with FPS drops, stutterings, and frame drops. So just click on to check for updates and download the latest version of Windows, provide the best possible performance for your PC. Once you're finished, you should be able to end this task and do the same thing for your graphics card. So go to the application, go to the browser, and download the latest version of that just to provide the best possible performance in general for your PC. That's it for the video, guys. I hope that I could actually help you out with this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment, or a subscription. I'm going to really be thankful for that. And I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you, but I'm just going to do my best in order to help you out. Either way, guys, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one, and bye.